AG12. Welcome back to episode of Is and Worth It. So today the episode is this cool mount right here and basically what this is, it is a solar spotlight. So you can definitely use this indoor or outdoor. As long as you can actually get light shining onto the product, then you can definitely use this anywhere as you want to. So you see in the top part of here, they mentioned some of the specs that's on here. They mentioned the product is waterproof, but it actually had a lot of other functionality as well, such as the fact that it's heat resistant and also frost resistant as well. So when you actually use the product when it's really hot or when it's really cold, it should be fine. And then for this product, it actually has two different light modes. So it has a bright mode and it has a light mode. So you definitely want to adjust it based on your own preference. And I'll show you guys how to do it in a second. But basically for the product, it actually will turn off and on by itself. And basically how that works is the fact that it has a sensor that's built in so when it detects like darkness, then actually would turn on the product. But when it actually sends like light or when it's bright out, then the product will actually turn off, which is definitely pretty awesome. But first thing first, I'm actually open the product to show you guys what's included inside first. All right, so when you guys first open the product, you have to see that this is basically what it looks like. So the product is definitely well protected, but let's take it out first. All right, so when you take everything out, you can see that they provide you guys two bags of these mounting accessories that can use for two of the spotlight that is provided for you guys. But this is basically what's provided for you guys inside, if you guys can see. So right here is like the LED spotlight option, and here's a little pose or stick. They guys actually stick onto your grass if you guys want to use that option. Otherwise, you can use the other option that's on here where it's actually mounted onto the wall, which is pretty cool. So when we take it out, you guys can see that this is basically what the product looks like. So on top part right here is basically the solar panel, and right here is the LED light option. And then the back part right here is adjustable option where you can pull it up and down. So if I just want to pull it all the way down right here, then you stick the pole or the stick right here. So you basically just want to stick it in all the way like this. And then adjust this part right here and make it tighter or looser based on your own preference. But I'll tighten it up right here for now. So once you guys tighten it up, you guys can see that this is basically what the product looks like. So they definitely have the little logo right here on the side as well. So if you can see the back right here, there's a little button and that button is for changing the brightness level on here. So if you guys want to use this option, all you're going to do is just tap this onto the ground and make sure it's tight in. And make sure the solar panel right here is facing where the light is. So that way you can actually recharge the product. And then you guys want to aim the light wherever you guys want to. So if you guys want to aim it on the ground, or if you guys want to aim it on the ceiling, or if you guys want to aim it on your path or something, you guys can definitely adjust it however you guys want to. But if you guys don't want to use this option right here, you guys can take it out like this. And then see right here and right here, they do have the little two hole slot options. So that way it's actually mounted onto the wall if you guys want to. Let me actually bring this to a darker setting to actually show you guys how the product works and when actually it works first. And then we'll come back and talk more about the product in a second. All right, so right here at the spotlight, so it's a lot darker now, so I can definitely turn on the light. Let me show it to me. All right. So because it's so much darker now and there's not enough sunlight coming in, it turns on by itself. But once there's sunlight coming on to the actual product right here on the solar panel, it will turn off by itself. Same thing for this one right here. If I turn on, you can see it's super bright. If I adjust the brightness on here, you can see how much brighter it is on the second level. If I just want the light to shine on the solar panel, you can see what happens. So if I can see it turns off, same thing for this one as well. So basically when there's sunlight or any kind of light shining on the solar panel, it will turn off by itself. But when there's no light, you guys can see that turns on. So the product definitely does work. You guys can see how bright the light is. So that's what it looks like with the light on. And this well also when it's dark. I will come back guys. So now you guys have a quick test of the product, you can definitely see that she does work and it works quite well. If you guys can see, it's pretty easy to use the product. Literally all you gotta do is just leave this outdoor where there's direct sunlight onto the product to let it recharge and then you guys can actually let it turn on by itself when it actually gets dark. Only thing you guys really need to do is adjust the brightness in the back if you guys want to be brighter or lighter based on your own preference. And you can basically use this anywhere as you want to, whether you guys want to use it in your garden, your backyard, your garage, wherever you guys want to use it, that's up to you guys. But you can definitely see the actual product definitely does work. But that's basically everything that's on the product. Now to come unboxing and testing on the product, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for this product in particular, I would definitely have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want one and need warranties. Especially if you guys want to save money on your electricity bill and you don't want to pay like electricity, you can definitely get one of these to mount it on your garage, your backyard, your garden. So that way you can actually reduce light on wherever you guys want to use the product. But then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't need one or have this one of these, that obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you actually do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.